Hello. Hello. <clears throat> it is spooky season. I don't think we're going to have it on, but I'm going to turn my camera on. It is spooky yeah, season. And Connor has never oh experienced Silent Hill in any fashion. Nope. And I would never play it on my own, so here we go. Oh, uh, you know what? I am running a lot of stuff on here. Well, there we are. Okay. A lot of background stuff. Um, anyway, I've never played this not... either. So, <laughs> here we go. I have played other blooper games, and you know what? I enjoy other most what? of them. <clears throat> Bloober, the developer. Oh, Everyone's okay. Like, I heard, I heard, blooper. So I didn't. The discourse around this game prior was like, I feel like people wanted it to fail tremendously. Why? Why were they just upset that it was being made by a particular person or something? Because or was it very was weird. it a very gamer was it a very gamer take? Gamer take and granted, one of Uber's like games didn't have the best um, take on mental health, but sure. What else oh did they make? God, look at him. Um, the that medium. Is... I mean, their breakout hit was probably observed. Oh, oh, that's right, and they also they. God, they they copy wrote or they like trademarked the ability to do dual games. Dual I hate world. that. Yeah, I hate that. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so this cutscene at least is locked at thirty. So that's nice. I mean, this looks fantastic. Yeah, I mean that's honestly a good move for cutscenes most of the time because like. Like, there isn't a huge difference with moving images and your perception of them. It's like the frame only, rate matters because of your... It's like there's a perception in your movement that helps. It's only when I'm in control do I care that much about frame rate being high. And I've noticed I've noticed the difference, admittedly, once I started playing on PCs mm -hmm. a little bit more. Mm -hmm. But... It's not so, something that I'm as as worried about. So I'll typically, like, if I'm having performance issues, especially, I'll lock it at 60. Mm -hmm. It depends on the game, too. Like, if I'm playing this, like, a single-player game, I'm going to lock it at 60. There's no reason for it to go above that, in my opinion. Right, because it's also a latency thing, too, right? If Yeah, if I want to play, like, Apex, I want that at 144 all the time. Right? It's, yeah. In my restless dreams, I see that town. So where in the Pacific Northwest do you think this town is? You promised uh, to take me there shoot. again someday. Or the Atlantic Maybe Northeast, the otherwise known as New England. Well, I'm yeah, alone. I mean, I, I think this is this. In our special this feels time. very Pacific Northwest Freedom coded, Street. though. Yeah. Also, why, why the Jesus. Pacific Northwest? What's what's with the Pacific Northwest? I mean, it's been really racist historically. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, but like, why are spooky games? Oh, like, it might actually be media, partly the fog media, thing. Married. And like media about my wife's name. Small towns and whatnot. I feel like it's always the Pacific Midwest. It's ridiculous. Or the Pacific it's Northwest. Sorry. True. Um, I, I do think it's I has something to do with the. Um, Mary died of that damn disease three years ago. Sorry, my brain. Uh, I think it has something to do with the uh, the locale. It's. I mean, it also kind of does. I, I, I said that a little flippantly, oh, like it's a very racist street. It also has a very like. This whole town was our special place. Could marry it really has here. all of the attendant qualities of that. Where, like it kind of has a pretty rough history in many respects, but it has like a, for me. anyone could come there and make it make it. For a lot of years, mm -hmm. so you can kind of be a nobody elsewhere, and you can make it there, kind of like California in some respects too. Um, but also, the, the environment's just a little bit eerie. You know, you have a lot of uh, mm -hmm. little okay. towns that are fairly cut off by huge distances of somewhat Spooky. natural uh, forest land or whatever. Oh. So you get environments like this one. <laughs> 
there. We got a map. And <coughs> looks like I can go to the graveyard. So it is it is Silent Hill, not Silent Hills. Yes, that was for some <coughs> reason I for some that's reason just I a thing. I wasn't sure. It's just a yeah, Kojima that's thing. Yeah, that's the that's the Kojima thing that never <laughs> saw the light of day. Well, Kojima alone wouldn't have sold it to me, but Kojima and Guillermo del Toro, I was like, hello. But yeah, that would have been a good. I'm yeah, still. I, th- I think that would have been interesting. I might have actually played that that one. I'm so upset. I mean, he that's hasn't all... ventured into games like fully, other than More, just cameo. Oh, Guillermo del Toro. Yeah. Gorgeous. I mean, he has his he has his own interests though. Yeah. Yeah. This this looks very nice. You gotta Does love actually... mud. Yeah, when you do boot boot prints like that, well, that that developer probably pulled his hair out though, or her hair out, I guess. Or their hair Look out. at that. Um. Okay. Um. Because that would probably me... be annoying to do. Although, what game uh, was I'm it? I'm sure there's a. Yeah. We talked about a game that had like fluid mechanics in the bottles. What was it? Pardon my brain wants to say it's the last of us, but I don't think it is. Well, there was some of that happening in Hello? Wolfenstein, which is probably not an episode, may not be an episode that's up right now. Oh, yeah. And and this, and honestly, because of the season, this might go up before that does, because that just makes sense right now. Plus the algorithm. Um. Yeah, that it would be a good idea. Uh, I think it. What we discussed Wolfenstein, but I don't know if that wasn't a good fluid mechanic. I remember. No. It it looked interesting, and then you were able to tell that it was just like a flat disc bobbing around. Yeah. Whereas, like the one that I'm thinking of, it's harder to tell. Hmm. I do know. I do what, remember. Uh, was it the Was it the game on the the oil rig? Me, no. The name of it. Oh. And I'm wondering now if I'm confusing it with like a TikTok I saw. But Could be. on another note, The Last of Us Part Two. do you remember the rope? The crazy rope physics? The rope the rope physics were wild. Again. I, I love how... Also, knowing the way that game was made, on. someone probably pulled their hair out getting that right. Sorry, I just want to be like, can you show me the... Because that's the just a blank. The controller icons. Oh. Okay. glowy red thing is a safe land. Okay, are you able to see the front of this guy? It's like third string Leon Kennedy. Dude, that's what everyone's been saying. <laughs> Just the haircut. You can get the haircut and like... Well, specifically, kinda, like I said, I was watching awkward. Min Max's like, playthrough. <laughs> like, passively, right? And... Haley was like, oh, it's Leon Kennedy. And uh, Sarah was like, how dare you? <laughs> I mean, it, but come on. It's like you give that haircut, you give like kind of man of a certain size, that hair color, that voice. Man, once it goes into cutscenes, it's even like better, much better looking, dude. <gasps> Oh, sorry. I, I was just... Hey, it's okay. I didn't mean to scare you. I'm kind of lost. Lost? Yeah. You're looking for Silent Hill? Is it the right way? Um, yeah. It's hard to see with this fog, but there's only the one road. You can't miss it. Stay away. This, uh, this town, there's something wrong with it. And it's not just the fog either. So I think this is set in the 90s. Is it dangerous? Maybe. That seems right. It's kind of hard to explain, but 
I'll be the, the other thing that's worth mentioning no, about the Pacific Northwest and like the general region too is that you have a lot of like going. overall militia activity in that but region why? of the country. I'm looking for mm. like, Oregon, Washington. Someone. Uh, let me look at a map because I'm going to misspeak and then if anyone listens to this, they're going to. Me too. I'm looking for my mama. I mean, my mother. It's been so long since I've seen her. Yeah, Idaho, Montana. That's what I, I was thought... thinking. Yeah. Mm. My that, like, those four states, like, there's a lot of activity there. But I can't find them either. So it's just a whole vibe. If you asked about the Pacific Northwest before. So I'm it's sorry. A whole vibe. It's not your problem. No. It's kind of a cursed vibe sometimes, but it's a vibe. I hope you find them. And Sasquatch. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. And there's a lot of good stuff there, too. Don't get me wrong. I'm not just trying to make it just sound like a horrible place. I never lived there. But, um, See, I, in fact, like, I, uh, I've contemplated the idea of living same. in Portland or Seattle at times because it seems like a fairly reasonable city to live in. And Seattle is, um, like, it's definitely getting more expensive, but, like, as far as cities go, is a much more reasonably priced city. Yeah, than like a lot if, of others in the country. If I was like, ever as far as like what you have on offer in the city and what it costs to live, um, at least as far as like if you're not in the uh, the Midwest, because I will also yeah. say, speaking of and everything, uh, Minneapolis has looked really appealing to me in recent years. Mm -hmm. but, like if I was ever forced out of California, I would look at you know Washington, Oregon, and the mid and Minnesota specifically. Those are like the places I would look to. Yeah. I don't um, know if I want to. I'm fine with Illinois, but probably just Chicago. Yeah. If some people are going to hear that and go like, whoa. So I've never played a Silent Hill. Yeah. But I did watch the first Silent Hill movie. Can you turn toward the corn? The, the giant field of corn? Okay. Thank you. And. <laughs> <laughs> and, um. I really liked that first Silent Hill movie a lot, which mm -hmm. honestly, like, very, very loosely adapts the first game. Um, I, have a, I have a feeling I saw it a long time ago, as like as a kid. I th they nailed the aesthetic of the other world in that game. Like, it's kind of insane how they nailed it. But they put Pyramid Head in it, and Pyramid Head doesn't show up. I don't like that. Um, Pyramid Head is a Silent Hill 2 character. Which, I mean, it's not spoilers. Uh, Pyramid Head is, like, pretty iconic as far as, like, characters go. Yeah. The squishy noises are too good for me to be okay with. Like, whoever the Foley artist is here... Good on you. Yeah, just like mad Alan Wake 2 vibes minus the transplant of Finnish culture. His run is so weird. How is this a sprint? Oh, there we go. Ooh, rusty, derelict building. Went to town to get the window fixed, spare keys in the drawer. So I will say, the sound effects are really doing it. Just like the ambient noise. Rotate the key. Okay. Okay. 
How are you doing, Connor? Vibe check. I'm doing good. <laughs> like, I'm not playing it. <laughs> I don't have to worry. No, not particularly. I like how it doesn't show you any buttons, though. Yeah. It's yeah. Not, not ideal. <laughs> but I'm a, I'm a gamer, Connor. A gamer. It's clearly X. Until someone yeah. decides it's triangle. To open doors. Yep. Or. And then, and then or the game to try it. Or it's triangle for every possible action you could ever do. Or in Star Wars Outlaws, R3. Or R3. Love it. I actually genuinely hate it. I don't like R3 being a normal button for doing Anything? like basic like door opening tasks. It's fine for things like crouching, aiming. No, you crouch. Like that, if anything, you crouch with L3. R3 is to reset the camera. That is it. That's all R3 should be. Yeah, or, maybe. I don't know. Or, in an FPS, it's to use your melee. Sure. Doesn't, uh... Doesn't Halo Infinite still use R3 for zooming? I played Master Keyboard with that, so I wouldn't know. Fair enough. I'm gonna, say, I'm gonna say this is running at a pretty sweet... 60 frames consistently so far. You gotta love that, like, organ uh, hit. Is that an organ? Whatever. Uh, kind of sounds like one. But I don't really know the, uh, sounds of organs extensively. I do enjoy how it was like mostly just like a walkthrough. <laughs> it's meant to build ambiance. And this is the part I assume where you have like a flight movie. Mm -hmm. Maybe not open world, but like is this similar to like the section in Seattle or the Last of Us Part 2? I can't imagine it's that big. Maybe not that big, but like that kind of like give a slight not open world, but like you feel like you can There's a hub. It's a hub. Yeah. Right, fair enough. That's probably the way to put it. Um Okay. That's a Oh, that's neat. map updated um, they nailed the fog though like yeah and that's the thing that i thought flowers was that they, they were discussing is like it's not really that like the fog alone isn't that scary if you've grown up in places where it gets foggy mm -hmm. and like i guess i haven't not not anywhere like the pacific northwest but like it still gets you get some decent foggy days in the places I've lived. Dude, I remember one day when we were still living in Davis, it was legit like Silent Hill fog, and I was like, "What's happening?" Miss Cassandra, a customer came in today, ordered a mixed bouquet, red and white. I tried to explain it's bad luck, but he couldn't decide on just one. He seemed a bit off, looked at me like I wasn't even there. Then he just said, said he left. He said he'd be back to pick him up later. I just want to let you know since I might be gone by then. Excellent. Did you see that mutant roach? No, I missed it, actually. What is this? They really are nailing, like, not only the sound effects, but, like, the spatial cue of it. But I wonder how much that has to do with me putting it with, like, headphone mode in the game settings. Hmm. This would be fucking awful with my surround sound system, Connor. Just, like, too much. 
Yeah, it's like when I played The Last of Us with my surround sound eventually. And like yeah. all the clickers noises just behind me. Literally. I don't like that. Wait, which part? Just I how boarded up and just the idea of disheveled. That using doing that. You have doing that with brown sound. Hmm. Not a. Not something I want to do. What is this? What explanation yeah. is there? For this nonsense. But also, look at the ripples of it. Like, kind of. Oh my god. I'm sorry. You know, I'm not sorry. I'm appreciating art and technical prowess here. Genuine optical. Speaking of opticals. Yep. Like, how big is the scratch on your glasses? Uh, not big enough that I can't use them. Obviously. Moving yeah, down. this this is it a sign kinda... of a problem. This is a sign yeah, to turn it away. Is. It is totally is. So it's like right here on the lens, there's just a scuff. Mm. So it kind of just looks like there's a smudge there constantly, even if I even if they're perfectly clean. And it's like I'll okay. eventually not see it as I wear them, but then I mm -hmm. become aware of it again and it bothers me for a little bit. And then I, yeah, I remember I had a pair that I think I went to either like probably lens crafters or something like that and eventually like whatever one of the coatings they put on it probably it was right uh, hello more of that stuff um it's like stuff and the road looks gouged like <laughs> also right look at that Ooh. it's the small things connor in games oh wait Hold on. Okay, my dumbass is gonna waste time on this. All right, we've thoroughly muddied our shoes, Connor. I'm walking in water now. It yeah, have some effect. I couldn't tell I, you. The execution was bad. Hold on. Okay. Okay, I broke the illusion. <laughs> it was still fully there in the water. Solid auto truck. I don't know what that says. I will say the, the, the sound effects stuff is really well done. Because, like, a lot of games... Oh, God. Here we go. Oh, there you go. Hello? Hey, wait. My guy. I do find it... This isn't exactly an original idea at this point. But it's like, the uh, amount of... Mm. I don't love those. I don't love that audio. Mm. The amount of games and movies and like media in general is horror based, where like the people are just making the worst decisions. I don't love that. And of this record, as of this recording, we don't have our faces there, but like we're looking at each other. Yeah, and I'm gonna look Connor right in the eye when these things happen. I don't. That. Wait, hold on, hold on. Sound. Look at that. Hear, hear that, and look at that. Like, yeah. Perfect. Okay. So. I don't like that sound. That weird audio though is wor is like worse. I think or like makes everything. That worse. little like reverb thing. Not yeah. Reverb, yeah. And you can, like, definitely hear some kind of creature. Hello? Hello, indeed, James. Some 
kind of celebration because there were like weird little party things. <laughs> I oh, find so it wanna, funny like, that they explicitly wanna, like, point out everything that people complain about in video games in terms of like visual guidance. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. You can only do so much. <sighs> Finish your thought about people in horror games and movies for a, a second, because I don't think you finished it. Well, yeah, 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 yeah. So uh, it's just because like, I think we're about to do the thing you're talking about. You have the well, you have the thing. This has been done already, where you have like the horror movie where people have seen horror movies. Like obviously, Scream was that stuff like that. But it's just like no one has ever existed in the context of the world they live in for some reason and so it's like oh they see some weird person like doing a thing like this in the distance and they're just like and like doesn't look like their body is okay obviously no one can see that but it's like the weird like twi twitching movements that person was doing in the in the middle of the fog oh. and making weird noises and shit like oh my god oh yeah i'm just gonna okay. keep i'm just gonna like walk towards that i gonna shashe towards that and I'm gonna crawl under a hole in a garage door. Like, who is James? What? Who is James, by the way? Like, is that? Like, I'm sure that was what's explained, his, but like, what's his life story? Yeah, like, who? Why is he here? God damn it! You missed the entire premise. <laughs> yeah, I did. Oh, God damn. Okay. So, he got this letter. In my restless dreams, I see that town, Silent Hill. You promised me you'd take me there again someday, but you never did. Well, I'm alone there now, okay. in our special place, waiting for you. So he gets this letter from his wife. Oh, that's neat. Oh, that's disappointing. Yo, that's sound effect, though. Sorry, I don't know how I missed that, but... But here's the kicker, Connor. She's dead. She died of a disease. So who well, sent the letter? Okay. I'm sorry I'm being flippant about it, but that's the premise. Was that like you already knew You already knew she was dead or something? Okay. Yeah, he, um, he, he like okay, did a little monologue. Enough, but... He did a little monologue about... But, like, again, haven't seen horror. Like, I don't know. You hire a private investigator... Health drink. What's gonna happen, game? Why do I need to use a health, use drink, a health game? drink? It's interesting that they chose this one to remake Ow. first this was more popular right I think, that. I think it's like the most beloved of the the bunch again the sound design is so good That looks a lot like the um, one of the monsters in Sons of the Forest. Mm -hmm. Also, I will say, not that I wouldn't be scared of that thing if it were attacking me, 
but that was moderately underwhelming as far as how that thing looks. <laughs> I'm just going to be honest. That's fair. It wasn't this? really as frightening as it uh, syringe. Okay. ought to have been. Old G syringe. Well, I don't think it got me too bad. Oh my god. Hopefully that doesn't become too much of a problem. Or is it... I think the game is a little loud in my ears too, so I'm gonna turn it down a tiny bit. You know, it'd be kind of neat, a horror game that like is super colorful. Which honestly, part of like, um, what was it? Still wakes the deep. Got really colorful and pretty, like with their set design. Yeah, that's true. Because th that is definitely something this game is still falling into is kind of the drab color palette. And honestly, that's my general complaint with like a lot of um, TV shows too. Is like. A lot of them, for some reason, go for that drag like the color last, palette. The last season of Game of Thrones. Yeah, or like they go for that I, like, I, that I, I blue look. I didn't even watch it, but I heard like from so many people how dark the scenes were and how hard it was to see anything if you didn't have like the right kind of TV with the right kind of color contrast. Neely's Bar. Okay. Guess we're going to Neely's Bar. So down Martin Street, straight ahead. Oh, hello. <sighs> oh, fuck me. Okay. If you're reading this, leave this place is not what it seems. Sometimes you just have to look behind. I don't like that. Those things, those things are moving oddly too. Oh, like the scraps of paper. Scuttling in a rock. Oh, save point. Okay. Thank fuck. Eastern South Vale. Do they mark save points? Yeah, I think they do. The big squares, okay. Yeah, I'm not a fan of how they crawl around. How they scuttle like cockroaches. I will say. But I will also say that, like, their appearance once they start attacking is far less weird than I was expecting. Mm -hmm. Okay, can't go straight, so... Maybe this way. Okay, let's appreciate it if I back up. Look at that. Technology, man. Oh, the, okay. Yeah. That. Let's go. Okay. 
like that one Kendrick song. So, are they wearing like There's high heel shoes? Well, we'll find out shortly. Okay, I'm like, are you the only one? All right, let's go. That frustrates me because it feels like like if you're in the middle of a swing, you're just getting hit. Yeah. Oh. They're not shoes, but they seem to be like part I mean, of the you, body. Is this? You kind of see the platforminess of them. You kind of see a shoe there. Yeah. It, I should not have been that aggressive. I was kind of noticing that, that that's how it looked anyway. I'm, I'm not playing, so I can't tell. But it kind of looks like if you're in the middle of that swing, you're not able to break it. Well, okay. And if they start attacking you, yeah, like I can't, I can't, uh, I can't cancel my animation. Yeah, which is unfortunate. But I hear you. Oh, mm. how do we feel about that scuttling, Connor? I don't like it. the bar. They also kind of have like a like a live I'm going to say this. I'm going to need probably part of this explanation. Um, it, it reminds me of the kind of has like a human gimp suit quality to the look of these creatures. I would agree. Okay. Look how legible that is. I don't know what got into him. He just started smashing the thing, had to throw him out. He ran off, cried, he'd fix everything. I gathered what, what I could. Still haven't found one of the buttons. Half the record is still lodged inside, but the other part's missing. Figure he must have taken it. Come to think of it, he did run towards Groovy. Anyway, maybe go check up on check up on him, see if he's all right. He lives over at Saul by the pharmacy apartment nine. Were you just saying because it's like you don't have to actually go to the text version to read it? Yeah, like. Ooh, it's the key finding event. Hell yeah. But it's also the John wants to find more healing items event because there was a hole in here. It's gone. What? Hmm. I swear to God, the chem's crashing through. Okay. It's not a survival horror game if you're not also an archaeologist. At least a certain kind of archaeologist. Okay. If you're not also Indiana Jones. I think we're going to call it there. It's a short episode, but we had some hiccups getting <sighs> ready. Like my computer dying on me. Mm-hmm. Well, that's it. Vibes, Connor. What's your vibe so far? Are you stressed out? Uh, I wouldn't play it. You don't want to hook up Parsec and take over sometime? Not really. You're going to make me suffer? I don't enjoy these games. <laughs> like, you chose to do I'm fine asshole. with watching them. I do not enjoy playing them. <laughs> All right. We'll beat some Gimp Suits again next yep. time. In the attack of the attack of the gimp suits. Why?
I don't know if you can actually post a video like that on YouTube, so maybe not, but post a video of gym suits or talking about no. <laughs> with the title. I don't know if that can be in the title or not. Oh, beating on gym suits? Nah, probably not. Or attack of the gym suits. Attack on gym suits. Bye. <laughs>